Recently, Adobe has introduced their new Adobe Premiere Pro, which is Adobe Premiere Pro 2023 version. In Adobe Premiere Pro 2023 version, we don't get any major updates, but still there are some minor updates and let's find it out what kind of updates we get in Adobe 2023 version. So the first update is now you can add inner or outer stroke for any text. If I select the text and then if I go to window and then essential graphics panel, now you can change from where you want to appear the stroke. So let's enable stroke from here. Just increase or decrease the stroke size as your likings. And from here, from the drop down, you can select from here, you want to appear the stroke. If you select outer, then the text will appear from the outer field of your actual text. If you select inner, then the text stroke will appear from the inside of your text field color. And also you can change to center, which is this one. Let's increase it maybe this much. And you can also add another stroke and you can change the color of that stroke maybe a different color and now you can also change the path of this stroke maybe you can change to inner path and that will help you to add several dimension to your text if you like to design essential graphics template using adobe premiere pro then this feature will help you so now let's jump into the next update which is the eyedropper tool in the past version of adobe premiere pro the eyedropper tool wasn't there it was here in the right side but now the eyedropper tool is just beside of the color you can click here and then you can select any color that you want to use for the text right so that is the handy feature you don't need to change the mouse pointer a lot you can just click and change the color whatever you want and also you can bulk change the color of your text if you want to change the text color of this text at once then you have to select all of the text and then if you go to essential graphics panel and from here you can change the color of your text at once so you can see the color of the text field has changed at once so that is another feature and another feature is alignment if i select this text and then go to essential graphics panel i'm selecting the first one then pressing shift i am selecting the last one so that i can select all of the text at once and from here you can align the text if i click here on this drop down menu then i can select align to selection now i can click here to align the text according to the selection and then you can change it to align to video frames and now you can change it like this one and again you can change it to align to video frame as group now you can align these three texts at once as a group suppose you want to align it to the bottom then you click on the bottom section then all of the text will go to the bottom section so that is also a cool feature another major update is if you like to use motion graphics a lot on your premiere pro project then it is a good news for you so if you are using any essential graphics template that is designed in adobe after Effects, then you will get faster rendering in adobe premiere pro when you are previewing the template right if i play it back you can see it is much much responsive than uh, before again if you go here and then if you select another template maybe this one and again if you play it back it will respond better than before so that is also a major update also if you're using apple silicon then you will get better response on your computer if you're using adobe premiere pro there is another update when you are working with lumetri scope now lumetri scope will respond better than before in adobe premiere pro and also adobe premiere pro adds supports for the array alexa 35 camera including array raw and ProRes capture format so that is all for today i hope you have liked this video if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up and if you're new to this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye